a divine greetings family greetings to every one of us hope you are doing great today hmm. to abe yehovah Elohim, always ever eternal be all thanks in whose power we live move and have our be the breath of life a reason for living the very one that supersedes all the breath Hallelujah to that. Thank you, Abbe Yehovah Elohim. And now for the power and your wisdom, knowledge you use to fix all these wonderful, beautiful things together for the elect. Oh, now I just love you for that, Abba. Hallelujah. Mm. Thank you, King Yahushua HaMashiach. For the power of endurance to endure the pain, the sorrow, humiliation of the cross, and without open not your mouth. Mm. I just love that, and I say hallelujah to that. You did it all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ruach HaKodesh. Ha. For your divine power of teaching, cutting those things that is not needed, the excess luggage, the flesh and blood that can never inherit the kingdom of my Abba Yah. You took it out of the way. It was a, a stubborn block. You just roll it out of my way and set me on the straight eternal way to meet with my Abba Yahweh, Aloha Him. Thank you. And I say hallelujah to that for preserving me for the very best of it all. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Abba. Thank you, Yahushua HaMashiach. Thank you, Ruach HaKodesh. I just love my Abba. Mm, I just love my Abba. Yes, I just love my Abba. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. All right, now, family, with this being said, here we are in the heavenly court room of the Yahuwah with this powerful message that is for you and me, source of widow, injury, devil, and hell ministry. How a mystical demonic being infiltrated her, the one she see as old woman, dead, idiot. Are you ready for this? We want to shake the very foundation of a Yuri link of fire ministry. Are you ready for this? I may speak to the 8% to the lights under her satanic cadaver. We want to know. <laughs> uh, Hebrews chapter 12, 25 through 26, or rather 26 through 27 said, In those days, Abba Yawa shook only the earth. He said, but now he promised to, to, to do it together. He's going to shook the heavy. For those things that is not needed, those things that is shaky, shakable, to be moved out of the way. And uh, why the unshakable one to be left for eternal use. So want to go right there. Are you ready? <laughs> it don't happen again. Hey, Kurubushan, Dayaba, devil. It don't happen again. Mm. You people know how to lie. We're going to be, you know, so exposing your dark part. We want to expose your dark part. We have so much to fix in today. So we want to start first of all with a video. In our whole world, from our, from our whole mouth, she says so. So let's do it together. Pay attention, very, very close attention to this expose we want to do over here. Are you ready for this? <laughs> I love my Abba. Oh. Mm -hmm. I love Yahuwah. I love Yahuwah. Oh. Mm -hmm. I love Yahuwah. I love my Abba. I love my Yahuwah. <laughs> he want to tell Bunch of illiteracy. Bunch of illiterate. Listen, now we start already. Bible say with God all things are possible. Eh, the man, eh, the man, yah be man. 
I'm sorry guys, precisely, precisely, this one goes again for the Edos. So what? I mean, what they are, the devil fighting themselves. Because she's evil. Let's see. How Logun Warren you are, hmm? Thunder strike you in your was might. Are you using this common cheap prostitute to compare Messiah, the author of life? Ah, what bear you are, what your family will. In your was might, in thunder strike you. Fight. Her birth caused the whole community grief and pains. Are you called that one a good child? That is demonic child. Water of life that came to redeem the whole would only spend nine months in the womb. Messiah Tapology Moses was only spent seven months in the womb. What is he your is she's demonic three whole years? Oh, what there? Uh, what be you why out? Blasphemous camp. Mm. Mm. Punch of any trait. Make her to be relevant, to be special. Meanwhile, she's special in demonic world. Yuri is the one that killed her mother because she's evil child. Stays in the womb for a whole three years. That is satanic. Come on now. Mm. And you guys are the devil. According to the book you carried, the Bible. Content you to be the evil one. Mm. And so what? So? Ah, what be you, why, how, I will look up people, look at the way it is. And so what? Noise makers. This is your biography, okay? Very local people. So local. They behave as if they are in, one in their village. This is international. We can spirit. The birth has to cause the whole community pains. Cause your mother pains. Stays three old years in the womb. Come on now. And the community also has to suffer it for what they knew nothing about. You are mad. And they see people begging. You are mad. Absolutely. Shut up. Satanic people. Listen, this is the mystical being. Jesus is said like that now. We know that already. Of course. That is where we want to look into now. A woman. A old woman. <coughs> entered her. Right at Ring Road while she was begging for living. Close to Urba Palace. That is India spirit. The old woman. Sort of what? Do you see the biography? Do you see the origin? Of for you to know. Oh, is is she lives in the Yore. She disappeared and entered her. That is where the evil spirit infiltrated her. 
Karibu Shandaya, but you are very big, wicked spirit. When I saw this brief biography of Yuri, I said, What? A woman came to her on a peggy ground right at Ring Road, close to Urba Palace. And the woman, I say unto her that uh, when time comes, uh, take this power of salt and water, you're going to use it to work for me. <laughs> That is not blah blah cool. Now, who is the woman? We heard from him already. We want to also hear from our own mouth in our own words. All right, we want to play that. First of all, let me just give you the clarity or the picture of what Yuri Beth did to the entire community. She removed roof from their head, wicked spirit, as is a. This has his eye. Where is it? This is what the Holy Spirit did to people. I know. It's like all of that. You see, this is what he did. I'm just using this as illustration to give you the clarity of the picture of what the Holy Beth did to people in her community. Exactly. Exactly. You see what the spirit did? This is what the Holy Spirit did to her community. Her birth didn't bring celebration, but rather brought grief to the community. So who is going to celebrate your birth? Rather everybody is groaning because as a, you turned to wind and you blew off what is the roof that we're in there. Or what is the roof in our house? Simply me divine protection from storm. From sun, from rain, from wherever. Wicked spirit, you, you shade yourself and you hide inside the house. If you remove that covering. In their own ways, okay? I'm, I'm not the one saying it. Exactly the ministry, ministry she came with Yahushua HaMashiach. The west of the cross is our divine covering, the roof. The banners over us, the Bible, you should remove it. And I begin to pour salt and water in people's belly. It makes the, she makes them naked, exactly the signs of her birth. She makes the community naked. The weird wind that blew removed every house's uh, roofing. So come on now. Think about that. What, what what did her birth brought to the community? Joy or pains? That is pains. Because everyone is naked. Everyone is panicking. What, what, what is going on? Maybe some don't even have money to face it back. That is what the birth of Yuri means. Now you say Yuri spent three years. <laughs> Let me tell you, you people know how to lie. I'm also going to play this before we play the real origin of Yuri. John C. Sulema, don't tell me this in law, okay? <laughs> People don't want to lie. Now, come on, John C. Sulema, I want to tell you guys that the um, he carried PhD in telling lies. Listen. I don't see anything. Oh, I'm glad he will be. Did you just get that? <laughs> Did you just get that? <laughs> Don't do nothing. Go and meet Justice Sulema. Let him teach you how to lie. <laughs> you thought you were, you were special. You were divine. What about this one that spent a whole 11 years? Let me not call it a lie. But let me give it to you guys as you said. That is satanic children. Because it's not found in our scripture. The only thing we'll find in our scripture is nine months. That's the deliverance. And the biblical Messiah spent nine hours. Right at the cross. Why? Because he was giving the whole world birth. He was giving us a new birth. Just like a woman. Okay. Carry pregnancy for nine months. Now, now you must come down. And at the ninth hour. Yahushua gave up the spirit. That fulfilled our rebirthing. Okay. Now Messiah Tapology. Which is Moshe. He also spent seven months in the womb. And when he was birthed. The whole house was lighting up with lights. The same with Messiah. 
and the same with uh, Noah. Your house was filled with light. That is a good sign. Not for you, your own. Cause grief, pains, waste of money, panicky to people. And you are not saying the devil wanted you not to come. Meanwhile, you are the devil that is coming to terrorize the whole world. For especially the Edo tribes. You messed it up. You make be full of that tribe. But you're going to pay so dearly for that. So you spent three years. That is a demon that delays glory. And you, you just heard from Joseph Suleiman, 11 years. <laughs> Demonic people. These are giants. These are seed of serpent. This is no good sign to be proud of. To be proud of. Nah. This, rather you should be ashamed of yourself. That you carry a demonic and a wicked sign on your birth. Now nah, this is my birth. I first of all narrated it. I was being deported three whole times from this western world. Paid my dad before he knew they would send me back home. Paid my dad before he knew they would send me back home. Until the third time. And my mother has never ever revealed this secret to me. What happened? When I be deported the third time, I returned back to my mother again. Empty, hand, empty handed. My brother now said, my daughter, don't worry. The most High is in control. In fact, this is the birth of your son. Only the most High is going to fix things in your life. Only the most High is going to make your life good. He said when she was pregnant with me, now, do you already nine months, you know, the baby needs to come out. Now, I was being birthed over 40 years ago in the in the, a, a community called Ewesi, a village called Ewesi. That is my father's uh, uh, place, okay? Now, we only get two means to get water in that village. Either you go to the river or you buy from water tank. That is dry season, rainy season. We don't buy no water because we always get rain from Yahoo. But I was birth on a dry season, okay? So on dry season, we only get this, the two ways we get water, the mix. We get water, okay? Because there's no running water. Either you go to the river to fetch water or you will buy water from the water tanker, all right? So now three days to my birth, the water tanker ceased to come ceased to come my mother said like today she waited that they did come now she's the body is giving her son already that the baby any moment from now will come down so she waited for a whole today water tanker did not come now she proceeded to tomorrow she waited water tanker did not come now the third day i must be birth therefore she has to call my father and say i'm waiting for water tanker the few water in the house, I use it to wash blood and clay and prepare myself for the upcoming event, baby. Okay. Now, because I'm the first baby from my mother to my father. Now, uh, you have to get ready to go to River Ugo to go and fetch water. My father has double decker. That car they call double decker. So now, my father now said, okay, since no water tank can come, therefore he has to borrow uh, bar, uh, all these uh, gallons, okay. To fetch much water, many, many, many water. All of a sudden, because the water tanker refused to come, all of a sudden, my father, you know, packed things together already. Okay, he said, Before you knew it, dry season, the sky turned black. Uh uh. My mother said, She not said, Uh uh. What is, what is going on? It's like rain one to four. Me, what is dry season? Rain one to four. Uh uh. What is going on? Before you knew it, kutu kutu. <laughs> My mother said the way that ray, you know, poured down from the sky, it was like kind of a magic. It grew, it grew, it grew everywhere. Is it within 30 foot? Everywhere. The whole house was filled with water. My father didn't go to a river anymore. All of them I began to pack water. Every single drum in the house, every single gallows in the house, every empty place was filled up. My mother said as soon as everywhere was filled, they were packing water, including my papa. He said the whole thing stopped one time, posa, just like magic. Ah, ah. My mother now said, what kind of rain is this? Okay. As soon as that rain, my mother said that rain did two things for her. The weather that was so hot became cool. Okay, cool down. And the whole house was filled with water. That's it. Before you knew it, baby princess came out. And that was how I was being birthed. Every end of place is filled with water. That is a good sign. My father couldn't even wait to the, until the naming ceremony. Then now, right away, he gave a name and said, This one feed my heart on a seven. 
is okay. Oh, na, oh, same okay. This one filled my heart, filled my soul. Prayer to the sun. My father saw. So my mother and I said, my daughter, the devil is just uh, disturbing themselves. But only Yahuwah, the most high, is going to fix your life. That was my third deportation. Likewise, flash the third day, water did not come in a natural way. But we got that water miraculously. Everywhere we are, you know, superb, filled with water. That is a good sign to be brag of. That is a good sign to be post of. Not you that caused the whole community pain. My own birth caused the whole community joy. The whole house. Yours caused the whole community pain. And you are not ashamed of that to even ah what be you were talk of that nonsense. No, let's now let us go to the mystical power. How that devil devil entered her. And when my mother narrated this a sign for me it's like i eat food for my belly was filled with joy that is why i don't bother myself that is why i don't struggle my life i don't keep my life indeed i tried i tried i tried i give it up and wait for him to finish to do it by himself because i know who i am you are talking about nonsense eh? dead people power all right quickly let us we, we head for that also <laughs> Okay, I want to hear from the Yuri also. Hmm? How she has said, where is the video? Oh, I hope I put it here. Let me look for the video. Listen now. She want to voice it with her own mouth. And she was that old woman returning back to this world. Listen. Mm -hmm. Listen. So the vision for her. Did you get it? She says she's the same that idiot. So please, can we use the <laughs> our words against that? I want to play. Uh, I want to play all the video because I have it. I went through them. I did the video already. It's on my Facebook. If you uh, my YouTube, if you want to, this is it. Just this is the title. Do you get that? Did you get that on my YouTube channel? Just put it like this. If you want, I'm not begging nobody, and I'm all, I'm not also asking you to subscribe. Not at all. <laughs> if you want, you're a one of Paris. Uh, Forty demonic authority from dead idea exposed. That is the title. If you want, so I want to play the. A visionary shark. That is number one. Builded with four cowries called Ubena Begi. The Romao. The other shark. The very other shark. So that boy, okay? Simply called Iiki. Did you get that? That simply means to say, if there, there is going to be evil, so either it happens before she passed or after she has passed. The These are all the photos India will use. It. The third one. The shark, she around her neck made with four leopard teeth called Iri Ogokina simply means to say to be careful the voodoo's Forty. in her chest simply called Okubaza that means to say no matter how difficult that problem or any problem might be they will break as a kind of assurance and protection but just like a, a bear to put fear in the enemy's camp. Other voodoo's she also tied in a waist called Okuba Awohami. Simply means to say that is, that is the that is the mystery behind the Yori Fasti. Okay. When she tied this Okuba Awohami, she can go on for days without hunger. And still full of strength. Okay. Another voodoo's under a lens called I did the heritage. It's our shams. It yeah, we use it to fortify uh, herself. As a kind of a protection. The very one that says she's not idea. Embraced tongues without being get shoot. Did you get that? That voodoo's this one. woman used to fortify herself is called Atete. All right. Simply means to oh, yeah, say, will you go on? Uh, <clears throat> any, whenever she goes to battle, she must return back home. 
Okay, the number Other one. Buddhists, she also used <coughs> to fortify herself. In summary, it's called Ukubasan. Simply means to say that except the elders of the night rules in her favor. Yes, except the powers of the night, the forces of the night. Anyone so rules in her favor, things won't get, you know, or she won't get the victory. So whenever she tied that to Kubasa, simply means to say the forces of darkness, the power behind her, is going to give her that victory. All these voodoo's is being sewn together in the animal skin or leopard skin. Leopard skin is being sewn together. According to history, when she put it on, she is so fearsome. Battle sword. Battle sword. She have two sword. One is called Etebitebi. <laughs> and one and she and also the power has she um, return with. All right. That simply means to say a arrows that is so poisonous. Okay. That whosoever she throw it at when it pierces that person, a palsy from this like a serpent bed. Uh, certain, certain bites. Mm -hmm. Another voodoo she again used to fortify herself simply called a big car where you will run. So that simply means to say when Deja is here right now, no, she won't be found there. <laughs> so as a kind of what? She's going to disappear? Mm -hmm. Mystical woman with mystical supernatural power. That's it. Finally, finally. Mm -hmm. After all such it's like I missed the my forty together. It 14 mm -hmm. This woman used to fortify herself, fortify her, her armies. She's going it's to go to Ibis Bell. So this very bell is going to be flying all over them, all over the camp of India. It's how armies, satanic that woman was. Making some terrible Terrif and mm. terrifying noise. Yes. As a kind of a, a matchy other war. <laughs> Okay, it's like I missed one, but let's nevertheless let's move on. I played 13, it's altogether 14 voodoo's. And in now up those proverbs says I'm here with Oma or Janity. I simply me translates. There is no one when it comes to witchcraft witchcraft power as idiot, no witch on earth as idiot, no bird is supersed idiot when it comes to witchcraft. You heard from our own word that she came, Babalawa told her she saw it in a dream, and Babalawa also told her that idiot has returned back to life. Okay, now you heard, so let's put scriptures now. I just, I'm just doing this for the eight percent people of the book. And that the satanic woman's voice. This one is, is this one is pagan now. Uh, uh, what giving us stress? Uh, oh no, this one is too clear. Oh no. Let me show you the old woman she always sees in her dream. The very one that gave her the sudden power, a salt and water power to be bewitch people into their coven. I'm gonna show you over here. We don't have no female or in angel. Whenever angel is coming into this world, they always put on. Uh, the, the 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 appearance of male they always put it on no one of them from genesis from extra book we have from genesis way down to revelation no angel when you come into this earth ever put on a female appearance not 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 even one only in one place we found that that is where we want to look into now it was demonic it was satanic i bet you one said oh my shepherd are male not female Check out the genealogy. It's always male. Okay. How about your wife's masculine? There is no feminist. <laughs> hey, dear. <laughs> All right, now, Revelation 12, 9. And the great dragon was cast out. Listen, that old. And he said, the old woman came. That old woman is in Joris' belly now. Because said no one can trace that old woman. Yeah, that old man was a demon raised from the pit of hell and entered Ijori. And that is the old woman that is doing all this nonsense miracle through her. Old serpent. Old serpent. Where? Genesis 3. What did he do over there? That is where he promised the power of feminists. 
That is what he promised. That is where he promised the woman that God had. That is the promises he gave unto the woman to be ruling over a man. And that is the feminist power we see from Iori. That old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceiveth the whole world, minus Iori, which deceiveth the whole world, minus Iori, which deceiveth the whole world, and was cast out into this earth, and his angel were cast out with him. That old serpent again is walking powerfully. It's the one she's seen as old woman. In the nutshell, it's a male. But why uh, is she seeing that uh, demon uh, as a woman, Idia? Simply, Idia once glorified them. Why she was on earth? She was so di diabolic. She was so demonized. She was so satanic. She believed in voodoo. She was never a believer. She never born again. She never believed in Bible. She always go war with voodoo's mystical power. Powers. But he has his powers, multiple powers. Okay? That's how it's deceived the whole world. Now, when you're so close, I'm not going to read that. I just want to quote that. When you're so close to 4 Samuel chapter 28, 5, verses 5 through 14, you're going to also see the old woman over there. Not woman, but it's a male. It's an old man ascending from the bottomless pit. And the witches of Edom, this thing in Europe is doing that a dead people can come and be subscribed for people. It is the dealings of the witches of Edom. That is where we get that power. It was witchcraft. That is what also worked with Idia. Mm -hmm. No female angel, because this earthly domain have their rules and regulations. That according to Abba, you want to put it together in this wisdom and knowledge. Okay? And say, angel uh, in heaven, they have angelic be body. Okay? But when they are coming into, that is the rules of this world. You can't bring that over here. You're going to be, you know, follow the instruction of this world. <clears throat> Excuse me. As Abba, you want to put it together in the power of his infinite wisdom. So to operate in this early domain, you must put on a human body. And any one of them that's ever come to walk this earth always put on a male appearance. No one, no one has ever dare put on a female appearance. So that was demon you saw in Fortress. They list, that demon lives in your belly now. They didn't see, see, they didn't see that demon ever since. Yes, it lives in you. We see it in our Apostle chapter 2, where the Holy Spirit came, he descended and he listened to us. You can't see, but see, you, you're going to be seeing his handwork in us, because he walked. He is walking in us. In like my dad, demon is walking in your, he listened to her. You can't find that demon any, never no more, but you're going to be seeing the manifestation power of the powers, because they have powers. You're going to see that from the Yuri. Okay. Now, Revelation 9, 11, you're going to see the king of the bottomless pit, that old serpent, where he dwells, is in the grave. He there is dead. And in the history, corrupt and perverse as the world is, lies everywhere. But there, they have never dared make such a claim that it is raised from the grave. No. He there is dead. She lives in the grave, eternal, to face the white judgment throne and be cast into fire because she was so diabolic. She never worshipped Yehovah. Whatever you saw, that is what you're going to reap. You can't be saved all demons using all these voodoo's. You say when you die, it goes to heaven. You are what I'm here. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So you get that. So let's put scriptures. Even the biblical Messiah, before he started doing miracle, he was prepared for a whole 30 years. All his apostles were prepared for a whole almost four years. Moses was, was prepared for a whole 80 years. When he wanted to do it by power, when he was 40 years, uh, 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 Pharaoh wanted to behead him, therefore he has to run for his life. He was prepared for a whole 80, 80 years. I'll be, I'll be on this ground. How many years now? Almost 20. Uh, uh, since, I, since I got born again, since I come to Yehovah, 21 whole years now. I'll be on a preparation ground. What about King David? David? He was prepared almost 30 years also. Who walked in that way? You just come from one demonic satanic ground and begin to use salt and water to do nonsense. And people say you are you are wickedly devoured in satanic ways. That's what we are saying over here. Now, I'm not going to be reading it. I want to give you the scriptures. Revelation. Okay, let me read here the first scriptures. 
Now Genesis 18 verses 1. And Yahweh appeared unto him in the place of Ma, uh, Ma Mara, or what? Okay. And he sat in the uh, tent door, the hut of the day. Listener too. And he lift up his eyes and looked, and lo, three men stood by him. And when he saw them, he ran to meet them from the tent door, bowed himself towards the ground. Three men, okay, that is angel, but they care because to operate here on this earthly domain, you must follow the instruction. You can't bring your angelic body from heaven to here, no. You must be transformed, okay. Now, 16. And the man rose up from thence and looked towards Sodom. And Abraham went with them to bring them to the way. Did you get now? Let's go to Sodom. They were all male. Oh, no. 20. Read it. You will see it over there. And there came two angels to Sodom at Evie. And Lord sat in the gates of uh, Sodom. And Lord, seeing them, uh, rose up to meet them, and he bowed himself with his face towards the ground, and he asked them, okay, he's speaking to the angels to come in, okay, I want to rush down where the man was, the angel were man, and he passed through them, okay, not there, where is it? Um, and Lord called, or oh, when the men of Sodom and Gomorrah came, okay, let's just rush over there, verses 8, oh, my maker, okay, let me search for it. Actually, I was looking for verses 5. Verses 5 now. Genesis 19, verses 5. And they called unto Lot and said unto him, Where are the men which came in to thee this night and bring them out unto us that we may know them? So that my Gomorrah, not that we are homosexuality. You see, angel, when they are coming, they always put on mere appearance. When you saw Genesis 6, you're going to see them over there, the fallen ones, okay? So they now went into the daughters of men, and they now picked the one they like, and they now married them. They are male, not female. So now I'm only going to be putting the scriptures, do a little explanation. Now, Genesis 32. Oh, where is it? Genesis 32, okay. Uh, 24 to 30, we also see our father Jacob, whom you call Jacob, also saw an angel of Yehovah. It was a male. It was a male. No one. We don't have any of that. Okay. Now, Judges chapter 13. Go and read it. The man of Yehovah, the angel, was a male. Read it. You're going to see when he come, came to Menorah, he was a male. Okay. Now, Daniel chapter 9. Verses 21, Angel Havre was a male. Okay, let me read this one. This is just one verse. Daniel 9, chapter, okay, Daniel chapter 9, verses 21. Yea, whilst I was speaking in prayer, even the man gave <laughs> prayer, whom I have seen in the vision at the beginning, uh, uh, being caused to fly swiftly, touched me about the time of the evening ablation. Did you get that? The man, the man, we don't have no female angel. No angel has ever walked this earth and come with a female appearance. It's never been done because Yahuwah hates masculine. All these angels, they are all masculine. You can also see that in the book of Jesus. All oh, the angels, the sons of Yahuwah, they are sons. Only the word had now. Ojori, oh, Afnia, oh, Azenda, wicked animal. Thunder striking Yahuwah's mighty name. Now, Daniel chapter 12, Daniel chapter 12, verses 1. Listen now, Micah, whom you call Micah, is male, <laughs> is a man. And at that time, shall Michael stand up, the great prince is a man. Great prince, Micah is a man. No female deceivers. Even the four ox men, I'm not going to read it. Revelation chapter 6, verses 1 through 8. Read it. What do they call it? The four ox men. These are demons. They are coming into this world to terrorize, to terrorize this world. They are on bail. Whether you are a demon or you are a holy angel or a fallen angel, they are on bail. Okay. So why the one you already saw is a woman? Prior to their, I have a brief biography. Now the reason why it was a woman, it is here. This is what I forgot. Horrible Shandaya. I will still do the history again. Yes, this one. That she used to tie her head. The two lightnings. Oh no. The two lightnings is one like this one. The one said is mystery. The sham buried over there is being called mystery. Don't know what it is. That's the one I, I will look for it. 
I kept, I just keep it all. Because when I did the research, you know, study the history, therefore, and I said, okay, exactly what is your research? So this is the one she saw. The reason why she's seen that demon as a woman, it is because that was the demon that worked with Idia, okay, empowered her, make her famous, popular, wicked spirit, okay. Now, India died. I bet you what has not yet judged that spirit. That is why the spirit returned back again. Ecclesiastic 1 now said, What has been will be again. What has been done will be done again. For there is nothing new under the service. That was the spirit that returned again. Now, through it, the very one that also entered her right in the Oba near Oba Palace, where that woman, where that demon first of all walked and terrorized, 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 terrorized the whole, uh, you know. People that refuse to submit to that. She goes to war, beheading people. Wicked spirit. Diabolic woman. Paganism. She was a pagan. Pure one. Wicked one. How tell you? Invoking the spirit of death. After that is to face judgment. Kedia okay, is dead. He's gone. You have never said that the idea resorted. No. So she don't resort. She's still in her grave. It is the devil that walked with her. Okay. That's why... The demon appeared to her as a woman. A holy angel can never appear to you as a woman. Never. That is why. When you also check out through the scripture, it was oh, me, he. The angel, they will always say he. He that thought with me. It's always he. We have never seen she that thought with me. Now, all the visions, always he that revealed it to me. He that thought with me. He showed me. He, he was, is always he. Why devour wicked people? Thunder strike you. Yeah, was mighty. I'm coming for you. You can read all Zechariah chapter 5. Even the book of Tobit. The book of Tobit. I think chapter 5 also. In Jeraphel was a male. Every other biblical text we don't have here. Every angel that surfaced over there. They are all male. They, we don't have no female angel. Wife, Nyawu, liars. The woman that come. He said to him, that woman is Jesus. Uh, what bear you? Even Jesus is a male. It's not female. Let's see. The only one time angel appeared. No, no. If angel did they appeared, a man of your saw a vision. Saw a vision. I'm sorry. Saw a vision. Seen angel as a female. Only one time. Let's see what that is. Uh, Zechariah chapter five. We are going to be reading it. Should I start from start from verses five or so? Then the angel that talked with me went forth and said unto me, Lift up now the eyes and see what is this that go forth, that goeth forth. 6. And I said, What is it? And he, you see now he again, and he said, This is an evil that go, uh, goeth forth. He said, Moreover, he, okay, not she, this is their resemblance through all the earth. Throughout all the earth, through all the earth, he said, "This is their resemblance. That is what has been before. This evil spirit is in everywhere. They are resemblance. They are the same seven. And behold, there was lifted up a tablet of lead, and this is a woman. <laughs> the evil. What did I say? What was there? And this is a woman that sitteth in the midst of the evil. Evil is like a basket, okay? A kind of basket where you put things." Okay, eight now. And he, the angel, okay, is the one speaking. And he said, this is wickedness. For angel to transform himself to be a woman, what? He said, this is wickedness. And he cast it into the midst of the heaven. And he cast the weight of the lead upon the mouth thereof. Then lifted I up my eyes and looked. And behold, there came out two women. <laughs> Altogether, there are three. That is Idia. That is Ide. That is a motor. Altogether, okay, there are three. And the wind was in their wings, for they had wings like a like the wind of a stalk. That is witch to fly. Okay, I was saying, witchcraft people. And they lifted up the effort between the earth and the heaven. Though this is Easter, okay. Feminist. Ten. Then said I to the angel that talked with me, where do this bell, the ephor, this basket, this throne, where are they going to, where, where is the stand of it, listen, 11. And he said unto me, 
to build it an house in the land of China, and it shall be established and set there upon her own base. This is only one time we hear angels being called her as she women. But he said, this is wickedness for you to put the, the appearance of a woman. What, what was he still doing? What, was, what, what he was still doing over here is that, you know, still exposing the promises of this old serpent for the angels they give unto the woman. Who was the, what, what, where is Shana? It's Babylon. Genesis 11. Okay. Who is that? It's Samoremos. Who is Samoremos? Is the mother of Nimrod. Who is Nimrod? The son of Samoremos and the husband of Samoremos. Says perversion. That's take us back again to Genesis 6. Samoremos was the wife of Nimrod. She is the sister. Ishtar in Babylon, Babylonian language. In English, is sister. Goddess of fertility. He said, this is wickedness. That is Easter they are worshipping today in the world of Christian dawn, in the world of Pega, in those that they call it Olokun. Olokun is a woman, which is Easter. Goddess. He said, this is their resemblance in all over the world. Okay. Now he said, Abyss. Shana. That is Babylon. What is Babylon? Simply me. Confusion. Tower of Babel. Okay, when men we are building against Abbe Yehoah, Abbe Yehoah, I'm going to throw confusion. And they are all coming back. They are male, they only transform their self to be women. That is what Yuri saw is a demon. Come on now. Family, we are done for now. <laughs> I'm coming back to this woman because she's so ridiculous. Bunch of illiterate, illiteracy. So we are done for now. Okay, this is what quickly I want to pull out from her brief biography, so satanic. Her, her coming into this world. Cause the very day this woman step her feet into this world, she caused a lot of people pains. She bring it busy, death to people, okay, to be struggling and face their hearts back, okay. Thunder strike you in your worst mighty name, wicked spirits. You are being rebuked in your worst mighty name. Thank you, Abi Yewa, for this wonderful expose. Yes, it, the light will be set free. Yes, they will be delivered. They are all, oh, they, they are the reason for this, sir. Yes, we just we are doing this to save the people of the book from a satanic voice. Someday, somehow, when you come close, you're gonna hear the voice of your father. You're gonna run out of her camp. She's so demonic. She's so satanic. If you want to know who is Yuri, listen to all the powers. India is 